I ain't never seen a turtle that big in my life. Which reminds me. Let's probably check and see when turtle season is. I'm getting tired of waiting for Mother Nature to make up her mind. We need some fish. Crappy to be exact. We're heading down to the creek right now. We've had two days of cold and rain. In some cases, it was heavy rain. Most of the ditches got extremely muddy water. We're gonna go down to Government Dock area where we fished many times before. Hopefully, the crappier in the mood because I'm in the mood and I'm getting tired of waiting. See you there. All right, well, we made it down to the creek. This is a dead end creek, you've seen it before. The water here will sometimes get stained, but it's never dirty. Never, I should say never dirty, never muddy. So we're gonna get out here, we're gonna switch over to the GoPro, give it a shot, and hopefully we can have fish for dinner. If not, it'll be like every other time I come over, we'll be ordering pizza. All right guys, here's what we're using. We've got that small minnow. Now the other creek I was fishing in, I had to float way down. We're gonna move it up a little bit because we're in a little deeper water here. It's not overly cold, just a slight chill, but it's windy, so I apologize for the wind noise in advance. All right, I can tell right now there's too many trees here. It's too windy for this spot here, so we're gonna move up the creek a little bit. All right, we're just about 100 meters up the road here. A little less trees, a little less possibility of getting hung up before he even gets to the water. Didn't work out too well now did it all right we're back at it again I'm not too happy with my barber selection here but that's all I had left try not to lose this one I think I might have out of bobbers after this one So once again, I apologize for the wind, the unsteady weather, lack of fishing videos. There we go. He was pulling on it. Again, I think that might be a bluegill because that's not a very aggressive bite. Oh boy. All right, guys, so I lost my last bobber and my last proper hook. So I cut down a hook, and this guy here, I'm going to show you what I did here when I get this guy unhooked. You got a YouTube channel? All right, guys, I couldn't get that back out. I'm going to show you what I did here. I lost my last, <laughs> my last hook. Okay, so that was pretty interesting. A couple things. The gentleman just stopped by. I've seen my YouTube channel before. But here's what I got going on. So I've lost my last hooks. I took a I took a small hook, cut the string off it. I've got these crappy baits here. Okay, I'm just cutting the legs off them. 
and I'm just feeding it through. I guess we could call it a uh, miniature wacky rig. Okay? It's like that. I don't have any floats either. So I'm just fishing in shore. As you saw, that bluegill choked it. Let's go down and see if we can get something else. If we get something a little bit bigger, that would be ideal. I'll keep them. I don't know if you can see it. This is how I'm working it, just like a wacky rig. It doesn't sink very fast, which works. Now he took that as soon as it cleared that rock. I let it drop, he came up and took it. I thought I had the camera rolling, but I didn't. Trying to make something out of nothing, guys. This is so light, there's no way you're gonna cast this thing. Bluegill seem to like this. Just like that. All right. He's a little bit bigger. Not much, but he's a little bit bigger. Nice. on the makeshift wacky rig. So what happened guys, I didn't check my tackle before I left. Didn't bring enough bobbers. I didn't bring enough floats. Which left me kind of stranded. I should have known being as windy as it is, I was gonna lose something. This is it, no float. No float, no nothing. Look at the size of that turtle. Man, oh man, that's a big one. Oh my God. Well, trying to make something out of nothing. I actually worked, I got two nice bluegill, but I didn't keep them, they weren't quite big enough, but I lost my last bobber. Lost my last hook. Well, my last crappy setup. So I had to rig something up. Took a real small hook, cut the string off it. Took a piece, just a piece, just a leg off of one of those. A piece or a leg? Is that a piece or a leg? Just took the yellow leg of, <laughs> actually rigged it up like a wacky rig. Very small wacky rig, no less. So before I turned the camera on, I had no faith in this whatsoever. So I dropped in the water and a bluegill smashed it. Now you saw the aftermath. I turned the camera on when I had him on the line. Threw it out a couple more times, nothing, nothing, nothing. Then another one smashed it, but he's a little bigger than the last one. So I'm thinking, can't believe this. If you run out of tackle or you lose your last of something, try and make something. And I could have had bluegill for dinner. I'm happy with that. You see the size of that turtle? I ain't never seen a turtle that big in my life. Which reminds me. I should probably check and see when turtle season is. Anyway, that's all I got for today's video. Hope y'all enjoyed that. Hope y'all got something. You learned something. That's all I got. I'll see y'all in the next one. Hey, hit that subscribe button while you're here. I'd love to have you. See you.